Okay, so I just stumbled upon this full stack project using Langgraph and Gemini, and it's all about enhancing research with conversational AI. Oh, wow. That's already intriguing. How does this combination of Langgraph and Google's Gemini work together? Right? It's designed to generate search queries dynamically and refine them through web research. Imagine AI brainstorming search terms. That's wild. So it's like having a smart assistant that's actually learning from each search and figuring out what's missing. Exactly. It generates and reflects on its findings to identify knowledge gaps, like a student digging deeper into a topic. Wow, I can see that being a game changer for research. It could save people so much time. Totally. And the iterative refinement process means it doesn't just stop at surface level info. So it keeps going until it feels it has a solid answer? That's pretty impressive for a back-end AI. Yes. Once it decides the information is sufficient, it synthesizes everything and adds citations. It's like an ultimate research buddy. That's really interesting because it addresses the common issue of unreliable sources. You get the research and references. Exactly. And the integration of the Google Search API means it's tapping into a wealth of updated information. Such a smart move. So it's not just doing static lookups. It's a living, breathing research agent. Right. And you can view the entire process through the Langgraph UI, which makes it super accessible. I love that. By visualizing the research journey, it helps users understand how the AI came up with its final answer. Exactly. And they have a hot reloading feature for development, which is such a nice touch. Ah, that must make debugging way more efficient. It sounds like a well-thought-out system. Yes. And they've even split the project into front-end and back-end directories, which helps maintain clarity. That's really smart. Separation of concerns is vital in full-stack development. It keeps things organized. Definitely. Now, here's where it gets even more fascinating. The back-end agent actually uses Python with FastAPI. Ooh, FastAPI is great for creating APIs quickly. That choice makes sense for handling requests efficiently. Totally. And with Python's ecosystem for data handling, it's a powerful combination for building research tools. And considering this uses Postgres for storing state and Redis for real-time outputs, that's robust architecture. Exactly. So you get both speed with Redis and reliability with Postgres. It's the best of both worlds. This is seriously making me rethink how we approach research and AI integration. Right? It's like we're moving closer to a world where AI can really enhance our learning experiences. So it's not just about fetching info, but developing a richer understanding of topics through iterations. Yes, this could really help students and professionals alike. Imagine the implications for education. Absolutely. But I wonder about accuracy. Does it have mechanisms to verify the information? Great question. The reflective reasoning aspect seems key for assessing whether the gathered info is adequate. That makes sense. As it refines its queries, it could hollow out unreliable results. Exactly. It's like the AI is tuning itself to find the best and most relevant sources. This is blowing my mind. Data reliability coupled with dynamic search. Truly a step towards AI experts. Totally. And this is just the beginning. Deployment features like Docker make it even easier for developers. Wow. So this could even be used by smaller teams or individuals without a huge setup. Exactly. It democratizes access to powerful research tools. That changes everything. Right. So more people could engage in deep research without needing a PhD. And that opens the door for innovative ideas to flourish. Just imagine. This makes me wonder about the future of AI in academia. These tools can empower a generation. Definitely. And the implications for enhancing critical thinking skills are huge, too. Absolutely. So what's next? Do you think this could lead to better project outcomes? For sure. If AI can boost research efficiency, imagine the quality of the work we could produce. I'm feeling inspired already. This is going to shape how knowledge is created and consumed. Exactly. It's an exciting time for education and AI. The future looks bright.